Guess what, everybody? Today is Menace's birthday. Yeah. yeah. It's October. And you know what that means. It's Menace's birthday month. The countdown is on. Yeah, and today's the official day. Can't wait. And so uh, the big <laughs> celebration, though, was over the weekend. It was. His fiance, and we just heard about this. We didn't know it was happening until Friday. But his mm-hmm. fiance was surprising him with a surprise weekend trip to a Secret destination trip. unknown. Yeah. yeah. And so she even packed his bag. Didn't know until what? You got to the airport? Yeah. And I finally saw, like, uh, on Friday after you got yeah. to Nashville, Tennessee. Now, what made uh, what what made you guys decide? Well, what made her decide on Nashville? Uh, it's always been on our list of places that we wanted to go. You haven't um, been there before? Never been to Nashville. Really? And uh, But real quick, on the way to the airport, she fulfilled fulfilled one of my dreams of being in a sprinter. You know, I, I've always talked mm-hmm. about mm-hmm. sprinter fans. Dude. Yeah, that thing was awesome. It rules. I thought that was right. the trip. A like, private jet or something. Yeah, like a sprinter like, to somewhere. Yeah, a sprinter is yeah, it's pretty much like being in a private jet on your way to the airport. It yeah. had multiple televisions in it and it's it's super legit. It's the only way I want to travel now. <laughs> it is legit sprinter van. And it let me guess. Nice. Yeah. Well, it Menace has cool. been on this giant fried chicken kick for the past six months or whatever. Oh. Yeah. Obviously, quote unquote Nashville hot chicken yeah. would be, I think, the inspiration for this trip. Absolutely. However, he did post a bunch of stuff from the, restaurants, and it seemed they all had it was Nashville, all hot Nashville hot chicken. Hot. Oh, yeah. absolutely. That's like, as a Nashvilleian, born and raised. <laughs> yeah, we are completely embracing that. It's like, oh yeah, the, right here. Come it's been to, here forever. Yeah, totally a legit. We original. invented it. <laughs> Multiple uh, signs everywhere. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah it, it was so good. And okay, so I went to a bunch of different chicken spots. And uh, Seabass, do you agree or disagree? I think my favorite and best one was Prince's. Prince's is the original. That was it was uh, on the bad side of town. That's mm-hmm. you know back yeah. since like the 30s or something. Yeah, it and took then me a while to get there. About 10 years ago, everybody decided, oh, that's well, what uh, we've always been eating. Is this uh, we always went to the bad part of town right. to eat in this little shack, and uh, it's blown it up since official. then. It's it was good, so good. Yeah, they have a food truck. They have all kinds yeah. of offshoots. I went to other spots, but I won't shout them out because <laughs> Prince's was super yeah. legit. Did you see they a million did... uh, bachelorette parties there? Yes. That's the other thing that's happened in the last 10 years. Dude. Is we've suddenly, destination. Nashville is the destination for bachelorette parties. Nonstop. Well, it's, why. It legit is Nash Vegas. Yeah. Uh-huh. Like the whole town, people are just partying from 9 a.m. until mm-hmm. 3 a.m. Yeah. Awesome. And yep. then there's just like buses or tractors or monster trucks just going oh, yeah. all around town. Everybody's partying nonstop. I saw you went to a Casey Musgrave show. Yeah. Like on purpose? <laughs> on Friday. Yeah, I love Casey Musgrave. <laughs> Ray, you can back me up on yeah. this. I've been he, shouting he's out. Been talking, about, been talking her about her for a long time. What's her wow. song? Yeah. <laughs> I think, well, I think maybe Casey Butterflies Musgrave. is my favorite. <laughs> Butterflies. Butterflies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Slow Burn is cool, too. But, oh. yeah. Um, and then, also, Harry Styles jumped on stage. That was a surprise. Hell, yeah. That blew up my Twitter feed. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dude, right. it blew up mine. Oh, wait, I posted it didn't about it. blow up mine. I posted about it, and it got 100,000 <laughs> views on it yeah. because he hasn't performed in years, and he just, like, jumped on stage and started performing with her. So, what was the, uh, what was the highlight of the weekend? The sprinter van? <sighs> The sprinter, Casey? I think. Well, Did Casey, you too the show early, was like really on the way good. To no, no. The chicken. Yeah. The chicken was good. We took this little tour around town on a golf cart. Greg, oh we're my god, on a golf cart Lucky. around town and awesome. drinking on the golf cart. See, it was and, like, oh, being, and how happy were you? It was like being in America. <laughs> <laughs> and did you see a bunch? They had those beer things where you like ten people sit around a oh, and pedal yes. and pedal. Yeah. Like, those yes. are illegal in a lot of cities. That's then, the worst <laughs> thing ever in the history of time. Those <laughs> rule. I see those a lot of places. That stuff's all they over. They do not rule. And then we went to that area where they had Marathon Motors, where they rebuilt it, where you can like go to like all the Jack Daniels distillery. Yeah shops and then also uh try all these different moonshines it's pretty much you just get turned up 24 <laughs> that's so yeah. cool it i thought you so went to a cool. third man records i went to third yeah third man records that was really cool jack white spot yeah. that was awesome and i don't know it was such a good time i want to go back that's also great. i stayed at the jw marriott if you're looking for a place to stay it's brand new in downtown man that place is super nice super legit yeah. did you get any barbecue while we were there no, I just want some just hot chicken. Ch- just one hot chicken all the time, and wow. then I I also did fit in uh, a Waffle House. 
Nice. As well. oh, yes. thank God. How was the, the toilet game, though, with all that hot chicken? Because that'll be <laughs> <laughs> hot lava. That's what... let's, let's just say Sunday morning. <laughs> nah. oh, it no. was a little rough. <laughs> <laughs> well, Medicine, uh, it is yeah. your birthday. We have uh, one of your favorite segments lined up. It is time for some raccoon news. Yeah. News. Rack. Raccoon news. Man, this is raccoon news. Yes, Dennis loves you. raccoon news. It's legit. <laughs> Our they're first always, story. They're always <laughs> up to shenanigans. Our first story out of Tampa, Florida involves yeah. a raccoon into some shenanigans. Yeah. He had gone and he'd gotten a jar stuck on his oh, head. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> Running around, yep. knocking into stuff. Yeah. Finally found his way up a tree where deputies in Tampa, and what they did is they, they put a big old sheet underneath the tree mm-hmm. and like another deputy kind of like threw stuff at the raccoon. Oh my God. <laughs> till it fell off into the sheet. They were yeah. able to remove the jar, and he went off safely. Oh. Uh, safely. Oh, safely, good. I should say. Menace, did you, uh, did you see the picture I posted for you on Twitter? Yes. This uh, raccoon poked its <laughs> face out of this abandoned 1970s Ford Pinto. Yep. Wow. Look a so little, cute. Yeah, look at the little baby. Oh, little oh, baby. Like, right, like a hole in the windshield. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. Little baby. Right yeah. At the Woody I posted yeah, yeah. On, on Twitter. At the Woody Show on Twitter if you want to see it. Next oh. raccoon news story, also out of Florida. This is out of the Orlando area. Raccoon news. <laughs> We're 85 year old Eslyn Frey. Okay. Oh, there we are. Oh. Eslyn. Oh. She was out for her morning walk earlier this month when she was attacked out of Uh-oh. nowhere. It was so fast and so vicious. Uh, she was bitten and scratched all over her legs. She thought it was a bobcat. It was so bad for, e- for Eslyn. However, yeah. when uh, Animal Control showed up, they found some fur, did a DNA test, and of course it was a raccoon. Ooh. No. Yeah, there's no dun, photos, dun, no dun. video. Nobody's surprised. <laughs> there. No one's surprised. There might be fur somewhere. Right. Around, just because yeah. it was some raccoon news. Uh, Eslin had five shots for rabies, and the raccoon uh, uh, apparently still at large. Because it's not a raccoon. <laughs> just giving rabies to everybody yeah. around. Yeah, exactly. Po- sounds like a possum to me. Exactly. So uh, in other raccoon news, let's go to Golden Gate Park, where a husband and wife oh. are taking a matrimonial photo shoot, which I guess is something you take after the wedding. Is it after? Yeah, I, okay. I guess so. Uh, yeah. They're out in the park, and I'm who, who yeah. showed up? But a whole family of five raccoons. Oh, babe. Oh, babe. Oh. Photo bombing the wedding shoot. How cute. It was, quote, like something out of a Disney movie. There you go, man. Yeah. There's an idea for you. <laughs> there you Golden go. Golden Gate Park, you know. Like those, raccoon wedding photos. Yes. I not go, uh, you know they're freezing, those people in Golden Gate Park. It oh, yeah. It's so cold. This yeah. time of year. Yeah. Or just in general. Love Raccoon news. <laughs> Who cares? But You're doing it freezing. for the gram. It doesn't matter how cold it is. Yeah, exactly. Come on, Menace. Get some hey, raccoons. Hey, going there. It sucks. Well, maybe Menace, maybe you want to go <laughs> to <laughs> gold. <laughs> hey, golden there. Right. <laughs> hey, golden there. Uh, maybe for so. your next weekend getaway, you can go to South Carolina, and you can participate in the uh, current uh, raccoon hunts. Wow. No. No. Out. No. Well, what if I told you that these coon hunts, and they're mostly for like teenagers, Mm -hmm. are not actually about hunting and killing any raccoons. None of that actually happens. It's actually about how well you can train your dog to scent a raccoon. So what you you do is the kids go out there, Uh and then they get out there with their dogs, and they go sniffing around. Yeah. Yeah. And then it's how well the dogs respond to a scent trail for a raccoon, and then like, or can tree a raccoon up a tree. Like that's what your judge does. Oh, and then you shoot him? I mean, no yeah. shooting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when do we shoot him? Yeah, yeah when do we shoot him? I mean, that's cool. <laughs> Get to the shooting part. It's just, <laughs> it's just animals playing with each other. It's cool. Exactly. It's like the fox in the hound, yeah. basically. Oh, it's very it's adorable. Rifles, BB guns. Like, yeah. what are we talking about? Yeah. Yeah. No. Your grenades. O- you're only judged <laughs> on how you and your dog can find and track raccoons. There's no shooting allowed oh, that's yeah. lame. in these South boring. Carolina coon hunts. Yeah. Oh, that's lame. Raccoon news. No need to murder. Boring. Okay, well, let's end on this one then. East Northport, New York, where a man, he has a little uh, garden out back, and he right. says he actually encourages the local raccoons to come and feast on his garden and get little snacks. Oh, okay, sweet. Good. So that's all great. <laughs> but one time, uh, he showed up, the raccoon showed up. This mom is pregnant, and she's got a whole litter of little uh, raccoon oh, pups. Oh. And one of them was the rare albino raccoon. Yes. Oh, Damn. right. You trapped that thing. Well, that's what they're saying, <laughs> yeah. is that the chances of an albino raccoon, as we've documented before on raccoon, yeah. raccoon News, Very yeah. rare. one in like 750,000. Mm-hmm. Wow. Damn. And they're saying you probably should have almost ra- trapped this albino raccoon because they very rarely live to adult because they don't have the natural no raccoon camouflage. camouflage. Oh. Damn. Little beady pink eyes. It doesn't look like a bandit. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, not a natural born bandit. Good luck out there in them streets, yeah. albino raccoon. It's going to be tough. It is. And there's your raccoon news. News. Raccoon news. Man, this is raccoon news.